What's up, people? Back at it again on this beautiful day. Today, we're going to do a video on something a little bit different. The topic of today's video is called self talk. Self talk, yes, that's right. So stay tuned. We're going to get into it. You already know. Boop, 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 boop. So self-talk, what is it? It's something that we all do one point or another. We all have mental conversations and sometimes verbal conversations with ourselves that dictates our actions, our do's, our don'ts, our thoughts, our feelings, et cetera, et cetera. And to be honest, it's actually a form of communication. You do it internally inside your brain or you do it externally. Uh, usually if you do the second thing, people are gonna think you're crazy, but that's for another video. Basically, this video that I'm doing today is to help you understand why self-talk is important and how changing your self-talk can help you be more positive in the future. Think about it like this. You are your best friend. And I did a video on best friends on who is your best friend. Uh, I want you to check it out if you get a chance. I'll leave it up here, here, maybe there, 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 maybe somewhere around there. I don't know where it is. It's going to be there. But basically, I did a video on best friends and it tells how you're supposed to treat yourself. That video is gonna go into depth about actually you being your best friend, how you should treat yourself, et cetera, et cetera. So check that video out. So we have to think about it like this. Most people will agree that the way that you think determines the multitude of outcomes or the success of the outcomes that you have in your life, be it interpersonal relationships, be it family, be it religion, spirituality, be it material gains, be it completing a project, Whatever the case may be, the way that you think, if you have a positive mentality, usually will help you achieve success. Or even your failures, having a positive mentality helps you to achieve success. Now, if that is true, then the way that you talk to yourself is the same thing. You can't talk to yourself in a negative fashion and think that you're gonna have a positive mindset and then you're hopefully gonna produce positive results. How you talk to yourself is very important. Uh, I've compiled a little quick list, three things that will help you understand the importance of self-talk. Number one, self-talk has the same power as verbal communications. And in that being said, it can be used to build or destroy. Number two, your self-esteem mainly is linked to two things what you think about yourself and your self-image and the way you talk to yourself. And third, and also very important, if you have a habit of having negative self-talk or destructive self-talk, you can fix it, you can change it. Think about it like this. Your voice is something that you're going to have with you until the day that you die. So it's very important that the voice that you use with yourself or the conversations that you have with yourself are positive, productive, and helpful for you to get to the next level wherever you are in life. Think about it. If on the inside you start to treat yourself better, talk to yourself better, you can almost guarantee that the outside world is going to reflect exactly what's going on on the inside. It's just a simple process. When you're not happy, you attract people that are not happy. When you're feeling vibrant and energetic and successful and positive and you're just ready to go, you're gonna attract more people like that. It's a very simple rule of science that like attracts like, very simple. You can be your best coach, mentor, parent, teacher, advisor, friend, etc. if you just find the right tools to get your self-talk into a positive place. The point being is that everybody's human. You're going to make mistakes. You may even screw things up horribly, but at the end of the day, Making mistakes is not the end of the world. It's just a part of the growing process. What you can do is start to apologize to yourself for making that mistake and just promise yourself that you'll do better the next time. So I'm gonna give you a quick example as to how you can start to alter your self-talk. Let's say for instance, I've been struggling financially and let's say I just started my business and I'm having a hard time. When you start to have self-doubt and when you start to have that type of self-talk in your brain, you actually energetically better put, sending those waves out to the universe that is going to pick those things up and say, oh no, we can't send him anything because he's mentally not even set to receive what is coming to him. 
he's sending the energy out like, oh, I'm a failure. Oh, I can't do anything. I don't know what I'm doing. And if you have that type of mentality, it's going to show tangibly. So what you can do is start to say, no, I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm going to learn how to do something. Right there, you altered your self-talk from a negative place to a positive place. Social media can be very destructive of your self-talk. You're on Instagram and you're scrolling and you're scrolling and you see that people are working out. Now, working out is something that we all need to do. It's very helpful for us. So say you see someone who has a very nice body and you're like, wow, this, this guy, he's, he's built, he's got pecs, he's got abs, he's got biceps, triceps, the whole, the, whole, the whole nine. Makes you feel a little insecure about yourself. But instead of saying, hey, I don't have the muscles that he has, well, let me work out so that I could feel comfortable about my body. Maybe my body type, I might not have six pack and pecs in that, but I might have my body in shape to where I can look in the mirror and feel good. It's the self-talk. Change your mentality. If you make a mistake and say, in your, inside your head, you say, hey, you're a dummy. You're an idiot for making that mistake. Only fools make that mistake. No, apologize to yourself. I'm sorry that you made that mistake. But next time, try to do better. Or next time, you will do better. You change the self-talk from a positive to a negative. So I just gave you a little bit of examples of what you can do to actually alter your self-talk and put yourself in a more positive mindset. Let me know how you guys deal with self-talk. Do you treat yourself good? and give yourself positive feedback, or are you always beating yourself up and being critical? Leave some comments below. Let me know what you do to alter your self-talk. Links will be in the description below. Cinematics Music, Cinematics Media, uh, Cinematics Photography. Until next time, you already know. Boom, 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 boom. Temptation, and I came with a shooter. I'm ahead of preparation. She says she's still nervous when I touch her. It makes her want to panic. She want me to fix it. I guess I'm the mechanic. Her body responds. It's just how I plan it. She says she gets so lonely. Stop listening to Janet. Now her body's impatient, and now she can't stand it. Fired Earth with the wind. My heart, water, Captain Planet. She my kind of style. She my kind of vibe. Drink with future. What a time, time to, to be alive. alive. Thought she wanna dance. Why she grabbing on my pants. Look me in my eyes. Control them both my hands. Show what money brings. I could buy you diamond rings. What is toys without the chest to hold the things? I'm patient, girl, I've been